Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I am going to share the answer keys of UPSC Civil Service Examination Prelims 2022, set D. Okay, so let's start the video. This question paper is set D. Question number one. In India, which one of the following compiles information on industrial disputes, closures, retrenchments and layoffs in factories employing workers? So option C will be the correct answer, Labor Bureau. Question number two, in India, what is the role of the coal controllers organization CCO? Uh, the correct answer will be option A, one, two and three. Question number three, if a particular area is brought under the fifth schedule of the constitution of India, which one of the following statements best reflects the consequence of it? So correct answer will be option A, this would prevent the transfer of land of tribal people to non-tribal people. Uh, option A will be the correct answer for question number 3. Question number 4, consider the following statements. The statements are given, the Indian Sanitation Coalition is a platform to promote sustainable sanitation and is funded by the Government of India and the World Health Organization. The National Institute of Urban Affairs is an apex body of the Ministry of Housing and Urban Affairs in Government of India and provides innovative solutions to address the challenges of urban India. Which of these statements given above is are correct? To answer option B will be the correct answer, two only. Option B will be the correct answer for question number four. Question number five, which one of the following has been constituted under the constituted constituted under the Environment Protection Act 1986? So option C will be the correct answer, Central Groundwater Authority. Question number six. With reference to the United Nations Credentials Committee, consider the following statements. The statements are given. It is a committee set up by the UN Security Council and works under its supervision. It traditionally meets in March, June and September everywhere. It accesses the credentials of all UN members before submitting a report to the Global Assembly for approval. Which of these statements given above is correct? Uh, option A will be the correct answer, only three. Option A will be the correct answer for question number six. Question number seven, which of the following statements best describes the polar code? Here, option A will be the correct answer. It is the International Code of Safety for Ships Operating in Polar Waters. Question number 8, with reference to the United Nations General Assembly, consider the following statements. Statements are given. I am not going to dictate these statements, otherwise it will take much time. Question number, option D will be the correct answer, 1, 2 and 3. Option D will be the correct answer for question number 8. Question number 9, with reference to the T word in India, consider the following statements. Statements are given. Uh, here option D will be the correct answer for question number 9, 1 and 4. Question number 10, which one of the following best describes the term green washing? Option A will be the correct answer, conveying a false impression that a company's products are eco-friendly and environmentally sound. Option A will be the correct answer for question number 10. Question number 11, consider the following statements. Three statements are given. Which of these statements given above are correct? Option A will be the correct answer, 1 and 2 only. Question number 12, consider the following states, Andhra Pradesh, Kerala, Himachal Pradesh, Tripura. How many of the above are generally known as three producing states? Here option C will be the correct answer, only three states. Question number eight, uh, 13, consider the following statements. statements. Three statements are given. Here option B will be the correct answer, two and three only. Which of the statements given above are correct? Option B will be the correct answer for question number 13. Statement two and three only. Question number 14, with reference to the Banks Board Bureau, BBB, which of the following statements are correct? Three statements are given. Select the correct answer using the code given below. Here, option B will be the correct answer for question number 14, two and three only. Question number 15, with reference to convertible bonds, consider the following statements. Two statements are given. Which of the statements given above is are correct? Option A will be the correct answer, only one. Question number 16, consider the following Asian Infrastructure Investment Bank, Missile Technology Control Resume, Shanghai Corporation Organization. India is a member of which of the above? Here option D will be the correct answer, 1, 2 and 3. India is a member of all the above three organizations. Question number 17, consider the following statements. Five statements are given. Which of these statements given above are correct? Here statement 1, 3 and 4 will be the correct statements. For question number 17, option C will be the correct answer. Question number 18, in India, which, uh, which one of the following is responsible for maintaining price stability by controlling inflation? Here, option D will be the correct answer for question number 18, Reserve Bank of India. Question number 19, with reference to non-fungible tokens, consider the following statements. Three statements are given. Which of the statements given above are correct? Here, option D will be the correct answer for question number 19, statement 1, 2 and 3. Question number 20, consider the following pairs. 
here pairs are given reservoirs and states how many pairs given above are not correctly matched here option c will be the correct answer only three pairs question number 21 consider the following statements two statements are given which of the statements given above is are correct here option d will be the correct answer for question number 21 neither one nor two question number 22 consider the following statements of three statements are given which of the statements given above is are correct here option c will be the correct to uh, statement 2 and 3 is the correct statements question number 23 consider the following countries armenia azerbaijan croatia romania uzbekistan which of the above are members of the organization of turkic states here option c will be the correct answer 2 and 5 azerbaijan and uzbekistan other three are christian economies question number 24 consider the following statements gujarat has the largest solar park in india kerala has a full fully solar powered international airport goa has the largest floating solar photovoltaic project in india which of the statements given above is are correct here b is the correct answer kerala has a fully solar powered international airport option b will be the correct answer for question number 24 question number 25 with reference to the united nations convention on the law of sea consider the following statements three statements are given which of the statements given above are correct here option d will be the correct answer one two and three question number 26 which one of the following statements based reflects the issue with Senkaku Islands sometimes mentioned in the news. Here option B will be the correct answer for question number 26. China and Japan engage in maritime disputes over these islands in East China Sea. Question number 27. Consider the following pairs, country and important reason for being in the news recently given. How many pairs given above are correctly matched? Here option C will be the correct answer for question number 27. Only three pairs. Question number 28. Consider the following pairs, reason often mentioned in the news and country given. How many pairs given above are correctly matched? Here option B will be the correct answer, only two pairs. Question number 29. With reference to Indian laws about wildlife protection, consider the following statements. Three statements are given. Which of the statements given above is are correct? Here option A will be the correct answer. Statement 1 and 2 is the correct. For question number 29, option A will be the correct answer. Question number 30. Uh, certain species of which of the following organisms are well known as cultivators of fungi. Here option A will be the correct answer. Ant. Question number 31. Here option C will be the correct answer for question number 31. 1, 3 and 4. Question number 32. Here option B will be the correct answer for question number 32. Question number 33. Here option D will be the correct answer for question number 33. Question number 34. Here option B will be the correct answer for question number 34. Question number 35, here option B will be the correct answer. Question number 36, here option C will be the correct answer. Question number 37, here option B will be the correct answer. The option with the, with the tick mark will be the correct answer. Tick mark in brownish color. Question number 38, option B will be, option D will be the correct answer. Question number 37, 39, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 40, option D will be the correct answer. Question number 41, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 42, option B will be the correct answer again. Question number 43, again option B will be the correct answer. Question number 44, option C will be the correct answer. Question number 45, option A will be the correct answer. Question number 46, option A will be the correct answer. Question number 47, option D will be the correct answer. Option 48, option D will be the correct answer for question number 48. Question number 49, option D will be the correct answer again. Question number 50, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 51, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 52, option C will be the correct answer for question number 52. Question number 53, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 54, option C will be the correct answer. Question number 55, option A will be the correct answer. Question number 56, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 57, option A will be the correct answer. Question number 58, option D will be the correct answer. Question number 59, option A will be the correct answer. Question number 60, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 61, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 62, option D will be the correct answer. Question number 63, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 64, option C will be the correct answer. Question number 65, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 66, option A will be the correct answer. Question number 67, option C will be the correct answer. Question number 68, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 69, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 70, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 71, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 72, option C will be the correct answer. 
Question number 73, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 74, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 75, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 76, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 77, option D will be the correct answer. Question number 78, option C will be the correct answer. Question number 79, option D will be the correct answer. Question number 80, option A will be the correct answer. Question number 81, option A will be the correct answer. Question number 82, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 83, option D will be the correct answer. Question number 84, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 85, option C will be the correct answer. Question number 86, option A will be the correct answer. Question number 87, which of the following is not a bird? Option A will be the correct answer. Op uh, golden Mahasir. Question number 88, option A will be the correct answer. Question number 89, option A will be the correct answer. Question number 90, option C will be the correct answer. Question number 91, option D will be the correct answer. Question number 92, option D will be the correct answer. Question number 93, option D will be the correct answer. Question number 94, option C will be the correct answer. Question number 95, option B will be the correct answer. Question number 96, option D will be the correct answer. Question number 97, option D will be the correct answer. Question number 98, option C will be the correct answer. Question number 99, option B will be the correct answer. For question number 100 is the last question. Option C will be the correct answer. So here's I have given all the answer keys of the UPSC Civil Service Preliminary Exemption 2022 General Studies Paper 1. So check your paper accordingly. So thanks and best of luck. Bye and take care friends. Bharat Mataki Jai. Joy Ayokhom.